Safi kabisa bara mambo vipi natumai kwamba unaendelea vema. Ujambo na karibu niweze kukupasha yale ambayo yameweza kujiri katika taifa lako tukufu la Kenya. Tazamaji wangu naweza ukakubaliana kwamba nami kwamba serikali ambayo iko mamlakani kuanzia rais naibu rais, magavana, seneta, MP, CMCS, as long as uko katika chama cha UDA wote wamechanganyikiwa. Ni kwa kwa nini? Siku ya Alhamisi <laughs> serikali imeweza kutoa amri kwamba maafisa wa KDF waende kuzuia El Nino. Nanielewa? Maafisa wa KDF waende kuzuia El Nino hapa nchini. Na maafisa hawa ama wasimamizi wa KDF pamoja na baadhi ya marafiki zangu wanafanya kazi ya KDF wameweza kuniambia kwamba serikali hii imechanganyikiwa kwa kuweza kufanya maamuzi haya. Hivyo basi marafiki hao wangu ambao ni KDF wameweza kukataa kata kata yale mambo ambayo yameweza kutolewa na serikali kwamba waende kuchunga El Nino. Nataka niweze kukuelezea ni kipi hichi ambacho serikali imeweza kusema kuhusu KDF kuweza kutumwa kwenda kuchunga El Nino hapa nchini. <laughs> e, na tuweze kujua kazi ya KDF ni gani mtazamaji wangu. Jina langu ni Mr. Eagle 8. Ichindi cho kituo chako na nambari moja cha Kenyan Media. Mtazamaji wangu kama hujaweza kupiga subscription usisite kupiga. Tunasema kwamba ni road to 40,000 subscribers. Nilielewa. Ukisha piga sub, bonyeza kengele, upande wa kushoto uweze ku like video, alafu mtazamaji wangu uweze kuisambaza, yani uweze kushia ili uweze kufikia watu wengi na mambo yote yatakuwa sawa kabisa. Usiju kasita mbona mtazamaji wangu siku hizi tag ya Jumatano leo, yani ninachukua muda mwingi kuweza kukuwekea kanda. Ni vile simu yangu iliweza kuharibika, nikaweza kuelekea ke, ke inaitwa Calcare, ya, yeah. nikaweza kutumwa Nairobi. Sasa hivi sina simu. Hata yenye natumia sasa hivi nimeweza kuomba mtazamaji wangu. Na niona. Anyway, tutaweza kungojea wiki moja na siku kadhaa ndipo iweze kurejea kutoka Nairobi kwa sababu ilikuwa na shida kidogo. Na nielewa mtazamaji wangu. Lakini ukiguzwa, ukisema tuweze kupata simu ya 5 ama 6000 hivi tuendelee kusemezana tukingojea ile bila shaka nambari ndio hii hapa hivi. Kuna we, wawili watatu wameweza kusema kwamba tumeweza kuchangia. Lakini mimi sijaweza kukulazimisha mtazamaji wangu ni ombi langu kwamba tuweze kupata simu ili tuweze kusemezana. Sikiliza. Gachagua says government will deploy a KDF officers ahead of El Nino. Hey. Yaani mpaka miujiza ya Mungu, baraka za Mwenyezi Mungu, maafisa wa KDF wa KDF wanaenda kutumwa ili kuweza uh, kuzuia mvua hiyo ya KDF na kuweza kufanya maandalizi, yani mvua hiyo ya El Nino sio KDF, mvua hiyo ya El Nino. Sikiliza. Deputy President Rigadi Gachagua has revealed that officers from the Kenya Defense Forces will be on standby to tackle El Nino emergencies countrywide. The DP made the remarks when he hosted governors and other st stakeholders during the El Nino response and impact mitigation strategy meeting at his current residence in Nairobi. Nanielewa. Gachagua noted that the national government is ready to work with devolved units to help unclog drainages and prepare for the heavy rains. Sikiliza venye aliweza kusema. I give the government commitment uh, that we shall apply all the resources at our disposal including the Kenya Defense Forces he announced. Rikadi Gachagua ameweza kusema kwamba sasa maafisa wa KDF Sasa mvua venye imeanza kunyesha hapa nchini mtaweza kutoka mahala penu mnapoa chapia kazi muweze kuelekea pahala ambapo kutatokea na emergencies za mvua muende ku drain muende kufanya nini sikiliza venye aliweza kusema kwamba to unclog drainages and prepare for the heavy rains kama ni mitaro waende kuchimba kutoa uchafu hmm? kama ni mabwawa yale ambayo yameweza kuharibika waweze kuunda Iyo ni serikali ambayo imeweza kusema kwamba sasa maafisa wa polisi wa KDF waweze kutuma kwenda kulima uh, mitaro makarabati waweze kuchimbua kabisa waweze kuhakikisha kwamba <coughs> wako tayari kuweza uh, kujiandaa kwa mvua ambayo inakuja In his address the DP father urged the county government to build artificial waterways to limit service run of, of water he singled out Nairobi, Mombasa, Kisumu, and Nakuru 
as the sites highly likely to be affected by flooding as a result of blocked waterways. Gachagua anasema kwamba wako tayari kuweza kufanya kazi na makaunti. Hatujakata. Si hiyo kazi mtazamaji wangu ni ya NYS. Si NYS ndio wanatembea na vijiko mtazamaji wangu. Lakini sasa wakianza kusema KDF bwana. Kwanza mtazamaji wangu kabla tujie na mbali. Unaelewa kazi ya KDF ni gani? Si KDF ndio kama ni, 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 ni ndio sasa tunasema kwamba ndio majeshi ya taifa la Kenya. Wao ndio military wa Kenya. KDF kazi yao ni kuweza kuchunga mipaka. Na nielewa. Mipaka wa Kenya na Somalia KDF wako huko. Hmm? Kuweza kuleta amani mahala ambapo tuseme for example pamweweza kuharibika amani kabisa. Kama ni wapi kule Marisabit kuna kipindi fulani hao watu wenye wanaiba ngombe waliweza kuwaua mpaka maafisa wa polisi ikabidi serikali ikaweza kutuma KDF kwa sababu wale ndio wameweza kupata mafunzo kabambe kuweza kuhakikisha kwamba wanaleta amani mahala ambapo hamna amani sasa unataka kuambia kuniambia kwamba mvua ya elnino mtazamaji wangu hiyo si hiyo ni ni, 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 ni yenye inakosesha wa Kenya amani sio mvua ni, ni, ni baraka ya Mwenyezi Mungu hatujakataa ni baraka ya Mwenyezi Mungu lakini sasa hawa maafisa wa polisi wa KDF wataenda kuzuia aje elnino kazi yao ni ya kulima walikuwa trained kwenda kuchimbua ma mitaro ha? walikuwa trained kwenda kuchimbua mitaro hata marafiki zangu ambao nimeweza kuwauliza bwana umeweza kusikia ji historia yenye rigadi gachagua na serikali wanasema kwamba sasa mko deployed kwenda kuchimbua mitaro ha? mko deployed kwenda kuchimba sewages ili sewages kuweza kuhakikisha kwamba maji yanapita vizuri kipindi cha elnino wakaweza kuniambia serikali ni kana kwamba haijaweza kuelewa kazi ama tofauti ya KDF, NYS na polisi. Wao wanadhani kwamba KDF as long as wao ni wanajeshi wa Kenya wanaenda kuchimbua mahali popote. Na nielewe mtazamaji wangu. Tunaelewa kwamba kazi ya KDF ni kuweza kuchunga mipaka mahala kama vile tuseme for example Lamu, tuseme mahala kama vile Mandera, ha, maeneo kama Kilifi, Garissa, mahala ambapo kuna utovu wa usalama pale ndipo KDF wanafaa kwenda kuweza kutuliza joto kama kuna magaidi wayashambulie wayatoa hapa nchini lakini sio masuala haya ya kuweza kusema kwamba KDF uende kuchimbua mitaro bwana unajua KDF unajua KDF ni serikali kweli mnaelewa kweli mtazamaji wangu KDF ni serikali wao ndio military lakini sasa hata bwana Francis Ogola bwana anasikiliza haya mambo kweli kipindi ambapo maafisa ambao ni military wa Kenya ambao wanashikilia serikali wanaambiwa kwenda uende kuchimbua mitaro bwana serikali imeweza kukosa chako cha kusema hmm? we also recognize that with the expansion of our towns we have not much the drainage systems as required as a matter of urgency we request our counties to prepare artificial water waterways he added hapo ni vizuri mtazamaji wangu counties waweze kuchimbua kama kuna pale ambapo wanaona kwamba maji yanakimbia vizuri waweze kuweka hata vizuizi drainages vizuizi kwa njia ambavyo vinaweza kupunguza u, yale u, maji kuweza kukimbia kwa kasi na nielewe mtazamaji wangu this will reduce service run off and the risks of flooding more so in re, eh, residential areas hapo naye aliweza kusema ukweli lakini sasa mambo ya kusema tu kwamba KDF Hey, serikali yenye najua KDF ndio serikali ndio military sasa waende kuchimbua serikali iende kuchimbua mitaro hiyo ni kazi ya NYS kazi ya hawa mapolisi wadogo wadogo hivi kama kuna shida mapolisi wa, wa kiwango cha chini alafu wa NYS na hao waende wafanye hiyo kazi hmm? waajiriwe in fact NYS waliweza kust... nini kufuzu mtazamaji wangu hawajapata kazi waajiriwe waweze kuchimbua Yes, waweze kupata kazi mtazamaji wangu. Hmm? Gachawa named Siaya, Kisumu, Homabay, Migori, Kisi, Nyamira, Baringo wasinigishwa na Elgeyo Marakwet among counties likely to be devastated by the upcoming El Nino. Of course, hapa ameweza kuongea vizuri akaweza kuambia maeneo hayo ambayo nimeweza kuyataja. Tafadhali, kuweni rada kwa sababu mvua ya El Nino inakuja. Hata hapa mahali ambapo nipo. Mahali ambapo nipo, mvua imeweza kunyesha sio mchezo. Hmm? As you have noticed these regions are either in the Rift Valley or western west of Rift Valley. These regions are home to more uh, than a half of the Kenyan populations. You observed the heavy rains will be begin in October and last in December. Kama sasa hivi ni September maji mvua imeanza kunyesha kali. Imeanza kunyesha hapa nchini kali. Huh? 
hata bado tikifika mwezi wa 10 huo mwezi wameweza kusema of course hatujakataa mtazamaji wangu uh, lazima mambo na drainages mitaro iweze kufukuliwa vizuri kabisa ili maji yaweze kukimbia hiyo ni njia mzuri serikali imeweza kufanya kuweza kuhakikisha kwamba uh, wamejiandaa kuweza kuhakikisha kwamba wanazuia maafa wanazuia visa vya watu kusombwa na maji na mtazamaji wangu kama uko maeneo haya maya ambayo umeweza kuyataja na ulikuwa unataka kuvuka mto kipindi ambacho mvua imeweza kunyesha tafadhali njia dhari njia hatari kwa sababu unajua maji si ya kuchezea of course maji ni ya kunywa lakini yale maji ambayo yanakimbia kipindi cha mvua usiji ukakubali mtoto wako akavuka au mtume duka mumtuke mtume kisiagi ambacho unavuka mtu kipindi ambacho mvua imenyesha jiatari lakini haya mambo wanasema tu kwamba KBF waende kufukua mitaro waende kuchimbua ile mito ambayo wanaona kwamba haipitishi maji vizuri hapana hata marafiki zangu ma KBF wameweza kukataa anyway wazo lako ni lipi baada ya serikali kuweza kusema kwamba wanataka kutuma KBF waende kufukua mitaro waende kufukua mito ile wanaona kwamba ipitishi maji vizuri in preparedness of El Nino rains sote tunaelewa kwamba mtazamaji wangu KBF kazi yao ni kuchunga nini kuchunga mipaka kuweza kuhakikisha kwamba tunapata usalama tosha mm, wale majangili wa alshabab wa wengi kuja hapa nchini vitu kama hizo mm? wazo lako ni lipi unaona kwamba serikali hii ni kana kwamba hawajui lile ambalo wanafanya hawajui kupunguza gharama ya maisha hawajui kupeana ajira kuelekea kwa kabila zote mpaka sasa hivi wameweza kuingilia kikosi cha KDF na kuweza kusema kwamba wao sasa wanataka kuwatuma waende kuchimbua mitaro nasemaje kuhusiana na hilo mtazamaji wangu ingekuwa ni vizuri uweze kunipea wazo lako la maoni ili tuweze kuyapata jina langu nafahamika kama Mr Eagle Eagle 8 ukipenda tai ichini cho kituo chako na ambare moko cha Kenya ni media ukitaa ukishapiga mtazamaji wangu subscription alafu ka like ukabonyeza kengele utakuwa umepiga ama utakuwa umechangia kitu hichi kuweza kwenda mbali tena zaidi usicheze mbali nitarejea na mingi zaidi kabla mwenyewe ajeweza kuchukua simu